Hey yo guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to use the one and only Inkling Portrait Generator so you can make Inkling pictures like these. Like me and my sister did. By the way, these are our real names. But still, please refer to us as Red and Blue Yoshi. Or Red and Blue for short. But this is us. This is what we made. This is what we decided to go with. And yeah, I'm going to show you how you will be able to make your own inkling pictures like those. By the way, I used myself as this um, backdrop. So, first of all, the website name. It is not just inkling portrait generator. The website name is ikasu.lelog.net. So that's the website name. Just have to type that in. That's what it's like. So I'll let you see that. So might as well take the time to write that down or do your best to remember that. Now, as you can see, this is a Japanese website. So, uh, yeah. You can also see Judd Nansen. This is a Japanese website, but this is still able, doable for people who speak English. Now, before you start, you have to make sure that you have this checked off. Otherwise, you won't be able to do it. So you need to make sure that you have that little check mark checked off. And basically, I think the left one... Um, is the left one is making the girl character and the right one is for the male character so I'm gonna show a demonstration of that so once you click on one of those you'll get this little loading screen of Judd Danson as you can see you just have to wait a little bit and there you go oh, I clicked the wrong thing I think I got it backwards but anyway, you'll get this popped up. So this is where you choose your skin color, right here. Then you'll choose your hair color and the little design. Now I went to this fire design with the female. You know what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go through the. I'm going to go through the options for the female and male at the same time. So I will be able to do that. So let me just take care of that. But this is where you get to choose your hair color. This, these are the options. But yeah, um, with the male character, you can choose if you want the little ponytail thingy on it or not. And that usually helps us whenever you have a hat on. But this is the hair color design. I'm going to make it red because red's my favorite color. And you can choose how you want your eyebrows to look. You can have them like this. Or you can have them like this. And you can choose the color. So it doesn't have to match the hair color if you don't want it to. Which I don't know why. Then, your next option. Right there. Are the type of eyes and the type of eye color. Um, you can choose any of this. The last selection is different colored eyes. One eye is another, one eye is one color, and the other one's a different color. And this, the pink one, make it to what it is now. The yellow one is this design, and the blue one is that design. So that's that's the designs. Pretty impressive.
And you can choose how you want your mouth to look. Like that. Then next option is the type of hat you want. So you can choose what hat you want. And you can see how they look. So I'm just going to go with something random. The next selection are the shirts. So you get to choose the shirts. Type of shirts you want. With the girl character, you can choose the um, Callie Marie outfits. As you can see, you can choose that if you wish. You'll also be able to choose the Splatfest t-shirts for the current Splatfest that will be held at that time. As you can see, that's how it looks. So yeah. Then, you have these little things. These are just little add-ons that you can put on. You can do this. You can also add nothing. This little star at the end means add nothing. Then this shows the type of background. You have this little ink splatter or you can have these hearts and you can choose the type of colors and you can see how they look. Then the last option is making the name and that button will submit it to Facebook if you have Facebook and this button over here will cancel it. But yeah, that's just an example of how to use Inkling Portrait Generator. I'll quickly show you I'll quickly show you, show you how the um what the options for the male inkling are like. What the heck I thought I checked it. But that's what happens when you don't check it. You'll get a message from the website. What the heck? Wait, which one is it then? Is it this one? All right, there we go. So this is what the um, male inkling options are like. And like I said, you can choose to have a little ponytail or not. And this usually helps if you have a hat on that doesn't show the ponytail. And the eyebrows, the eyes, you can have the same type of eyes. Mouths. This is what I s selected. Different hats. Oh, and also with the uh, girl character, you can also use the Kelly Marie hats as well. I just didn't show that. But you can do that. You can do that if you want. And then these are the shirts. So yeah, pretty much the same thing, you know? But yeah. That's how to use the Inkling Portrait Generator. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you. And uh, yeah, if you like what you see on the channel, please subscribe. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!